Uh, welcome to the next episode of We Messed Up So You Don't Have To. Let me take you back here and show you what we've done. We're at the uh, Alliance Rally, and because the power source is so far back there, we're plugged in here, and we had to stretch it, and it had to go behind the tires and back there into the into the pedestal. And when it stretched tight, I didn't realize that the cord was sitting against the furnace exhaust, and we've had a couple of... Uh, cool nights furnace came on and it has now melted the cord away right there and we're lucky that it didn't melt all the way through and cause a short and cause a fire so we'll get some more screens too it's melted off full of plastic there we'll get some more of these these dirt dauber screens it went through the outer casing all the way through and then it went into started to melt into some of the inner wires there and so I'm not an electrician but that can't be good. Yeah, I just rolled up to the factory and uh, we got to take our refrigerated stuff in there. They're going to let us use one of the refrigerators that they have in there. So we got to we gotta put the slide out. We got to get all the stuff out of the refrigerator because they're going to have it for about a week. And we don't want to lose all of our groceries. Everything's got to come out of this slide completely because this whole slide is going to be coming out and laying down on the ground. And then they're going to take this, replace this slide floor. So. Yeah, everything's got to come out. Are you excited about it? I'm thrilled, ecstatic. <laughs> well, at I'm least we're getting fixed up. Tame my excitement. What kind of cookie cutter was that in there? It's a special cookie cutter. I saw a weird shaped cookie cutter in there. It was a gift from the Brazen Brit. Oh yeah. Yeah. We need to censor it. You might. <laughs> <laughs> you might have to censor. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. Me and Natalie made cookies one night. <laughs> oh. I'm not going to say whether alcohol was involved yeah. or not, but we made cookies. I can guess. <laughs> so now we got everything out of the fridge and the freezer. We're working on all this stuff. And then we got to get everything out of the fireplace, which is the liquor cabinet. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, every time you go through stuff, there's always stuff to throw away. Yeah. For somebody who doesn't cook, sure has a lot of spices. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> well, here we are, settled in for the night. We got uh, the last spot here. There's five spots out here behind plant four. They have, uh, they have power and water spots out here and uh, backs up to this farm. So it's gonna be nice and quiet, hopefully. Those slide skis that broke uh, that was about a year or so ago, I guess. We didn't think it did enough damage on that floor to be replaced, but it, as time has gone on, it hasn't gotten better. So they are going to replace the slide floor in the kitchen slide. That's why we had to take everything out of the refrigerator and everything out of the, all that side, all the Scout's stuff out of his habitat. And then they are going to replace the slide floor on the bedroom slide and the slide roof on the bedroom slide because we never could find that leak. Um, so they're going to fix that. Um, and trying to find that leak, I scratched off, you know, some of the decals when I scratched off when, when I went to reseal it. And so they're going to replace some of these decals that I messed up and then they're going to reseal everything. And then, you know, from the time that we scheduled that to the time now to come out, we had one of our pull valves. The great tank pull valve is now stuck open. The valve stuck open. Uh, and that's why I got the Valterra uh, gate valve down there. But they're going to fix that tomorrow, too. Oh, well, we just dropped off the RV. It's sad. It's sad to see the RV on the hook. It's like uh, it's like when a NASCAR driver wrecks and they're towing his car away. <laughs> get all sad to see your see your house on the hook. I need a drink. So we'll go get a drink. Like what kind of drink? Not that kind of drink. <laughs> and it's 8 a.m. Let's go. To, let's go to the bar. <laughs> I'll kill some time. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. No. I need. I'm parched. I need some water. Oh, I left our waters in the fridge. No, that's that's that. Well, we're getting settled into the hotel room. We tried to check in early, they wouldn't let us because they were short on cleaning staff. Scout's getting a snack. And he had a pause because I was filming him. He can't see it, it's in the shadow. Yeah, yeah, blends in. Can't get it. There it is. <laughs> so not that bad. Uh, we got a king size deal here. It's a little bit of living room. I got to take that cart back down. And we have a kitchenette 
Um, we went to home to suites because we're going to be here for about a week. So I even have my, my setup over here to do my editing. And uh, hopefully we won't be here for the full week. They said a week, but today's Monday. So I'm hoping like work week, Friday. maybe Friday. We don't have a plan if they get out early. Uh, probably stay overnight at the factory again and then head out somewhere. Um, because we were booked on a thousand trails the following Tuesday. So we have to find somewhere for a couple days. But I'd rather do that than be here in the hotel. Well, that is a wrap on the hotel room. Four nights. That wasn't too bad. No. We stayed Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Today's Friday. We're checking out. Going to pick up the RV. We're going to check out here at 11. We can't pick it up till 1. So we had to kill a couple hours. But um, shouldn't be too hard. We'll grab some lunch. And we got to try to find a place to live. We're homeless. Because yeah. we didn't know when we were getting the RV back out. Yep. We didn't have any reservations. And Until Monday. So. Yeah. We were staying overnight at the factory. Mm -hmm. Make sure everything works. We just need a two-nighter. Uh, three-nighter. Sunday. Sunday. Tuesday we check into the next one. Oh, Tuesday. Yeah. So oh, we need three nights. three nights. And all the thousand trails down here are full. We couldn't, we couldn't extend ours to go early. Yeah. We tried the military. It's booked up. So we got to figure something else out. For four days and then moved down there. Uh, um, found out last night we got a house. <laughs> we did. Yeah, so they accepted our offer and now the whole thing starts, man. New chaos for us to deal with. Yeah, a bunch of different stuff. <laughs> the, this is going to be so crazy. We'll talk about this more in a second. We actually um, can talk about it now because we've yeah. already released the video announcing it. Yeah. And so we can start talking about it and it's just gonna be a crazy time and just like when we Documented our journey to start full-time RVing. Yeah. There's a lot of channels didn't do that They just like day one they're on the road. Here we go. We're full-time. Hey, but never explained how they got there Yeah, same for a lot of people who come off the road They're like hey, we're out. See you bought a house. Bye. And that's <laughs> the last you hear uh, But we're not gonna do that we are going to take you through the whole process, process. the reverse process, <laughs> getting back off the road. So yeah. we're going to take you all through all of that. Um, yep. And it's just going to be crazy. It's going to be a whirlwind. But I hope it's crazy enough that it makes the time go fast. Yeah. That's kind of how I see it. <laughs> because um, as we are standing here right now, it's the early part of June. June. And because the people who bought the house from our military, they can't get out until the end of August. Mm -hmm. And so even down to the RV Unplugged rally, we're going to have to go down there and stay in one of the cabins. Yeah. Or if the cabins are full, we'll probably stay in a hotel around there somewhere and just yeah. pop into the rally. But we're not bringing the RV no, to the gonna, rally. When we get it to Alabama, we're going to wash her, make her all pretty, clean her out, and not move her. And I was just doing the, the math from uh -oh. our calendar. Uh -huh. um, we have six more moves in the RV. That's it. Wow. We'll move six more times. Dang. Yeah. So this, it's going to be crazy. All right. Well, let's get it all packed up and we'll head over and make sure the RV is good. Yay. Leslie's OCD meter is pegged. It's not good to have OCD issues because stuff like this just freaking tweets you out man yeah we just got the rv back and they did a great job fixing everything i just walked through with great. them everything's great so they replaced the kitchen floor on this slide and they replaced the, the linoleum down there it matches scout you can barely even see him <laughs> they refoamed all the windows uh just to make sure that those don't leak anymore we had a little weeping when it would rain really hard it would weep yeah. on a couple of the windows so they did all of that yeah they um replaced the slide floor and the slide roof on that slide and uh they fixed the pull handle yes on the gray tank uh -huh. and then we had our seven pin connector the cord was coming out of the the box a yeah. little bit showing some of the some of the wires I was still getting a good connection, but you, just, you never want to get moisture or anything in there. So they fixed that too. Yeah. And uh, we're all good. We are all good. We just got to find a place to live. <laughs> yeah. We're staying the night here on the Alliance factory property uh, in one of their spots Which overnight. Which is a good thing because we're going to need it because it's 
I mean, there's so much. Everything is covered in dust. Yeah, we still got to go get all of our stuff out of the refrigerator that yeah. they let us borrow, put it back in our refrigerator. Well, this is for all of you who commented when we did our pass-through storage video and said, it doesn't look like you guys have too much stuff. This is too much stuff. Well, too much stuff. This was all in the slot. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's well, mostly all that stuff out of the kitchen side, but it's pots, pans, plates. Everything had to come out of there. Fireplace stuff. And the fireplace. Scouts. It yeah. doesn't seem like all this fits in here. I know. I don't get it. So that's all that. And that's just for that slide there. And then... I put the bed together. You got all the stuff, you know, for the, this goes under the bed. And then and Leslie put all the stuff back in the pantry. So that's all back in there. But it was all in here. And then you got to put all the stuff back under the bed. So, man, it's more stuff than you think it is. And we were just talking about it. We're like, you know what? We just sell the rig with everything in it, man. Just keep it. <laughs> yeah, I sell the house furnished. I could sell the rig furnished. You can decide what you want to keep out. Because this is going to be a pain in the ass to move back out of here. I don't. I don't understand. Yeah. How this all fit in. Here. And 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 who knows? I mean, maybe by the time this video comes out, the RV might already be sold. We might might already be done out and out of here. I don't know. Maybe. This is coming out mid July. So. I just am floored by how much stuff was in this. It's a lot spot. of stuff, and. Um, I gotta go back over and get all the stuff out of the fridge. Yeah. The fridge still empty. Yeah. So I gotta get all the stuff to put back in there. All right, I'm gonna leave you buried in this stuff. Thank you. And I'm gonna we emptied all these bags here, so I can go get the refrigerator stuff. And I'm gonna go pack that stuff up while Leslie is painstakingly putting all this stuff away. I ever want to do this again? Why do we have this much stuff? No. <laughs> <laughs> Scout's like, oh, I've already been here before. Why are we back here? Same field we were backed up to before, man. What do you think, buddy? Better than the hotel, huh? Yeah. All's right in the world? Yes. Mostly? Yes. Everything's all put away. We're all yes. good. That was painful. That was very painful. I don't want to ever do this again. Yeah, we had a little bit of a scare there. Oh. Yes. We were putting stuff back under the bed, and I was like, Oh man, where's the safe? We took it to the hotel with us. Oh, we left it. And we left it there. So I put it, theirs was like mounted a little off the floor. Yeah. So I was like, oh cool, I'll just shove it right under there. You can't even see it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Easier to forget it that way. Yes, it was. <laughs> so I hauled back. And it's a little after three in the afternoon, and they start Check in. checking people in at three. And I'm like, I hope they haven't given this room away. I tried to call them, they wouldn't answer the phone. So I bolted over there and. Uh, it was there waiting on me. So, crisis averted. Yes. And we're going to go out to dinner. Yes. To relax and to celebrate. To celebrate. Because we just found out last night that we got the house that we wanted. Yep. And so we're going to celebrate tonight. Yes. Oh, and I forgot to mention we did get a new power cord from where the power cord was up against there, and I got new new covers. That one was already good, so I left that one, but I did replace both of these. And, uh, and we had to replace the power cord. So that was a that was a couple of hundred dollar mistake that we won't make again. We're all fixed up. The rig is almost like a brand new rig now. I don't wanna go that far. I mean, it's there's nothing, I mean, everything's good. Everything's yeah, fixed. Everything's fixed. So yeah. we're in good shape. Yes. And we only got six more moves. All right. Before it goes up for sale. So, six wow, more. six more moves. We'll count it down with you <laughs> as we go. Yeah. And then we'll start getting into all the fun stuff and oh my God. you know, getting getting into a house mm -hmm. and coming pain, off the road and the, the painful that. process of it. <laughs> and we have to do things in very specific order yes. for it to all go right. Mm -hmm. There's lots of things that have to go right. Yes. <laughs> in order. We'll get into all that later. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna go hang out and uh, stick around for a few seconds. We're gonna honor a fallen hero. Mm -hmm. If you want to get involved with helping us help veterans, everything you need to know is right down in the in the uh, description of the video. Appreciate you watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.